Hey everybody, welcome back to another Dragon Ball unboxing. I am joined once again with my sister, Juju Beans. Juliana, why don't you tell the people a little bit more about Hope Restored, who missed it last time. Yeah, um, hoperestored.us. We exist to counsel, mentor, disciple women um, that have suffered from domestic violence abuse or are currently in that situation and uh, need help getting out of it or need um, counsel through that. So that's what we're about, through the hope of Jesus Christ. Cool, and where can they find you? At hoperestored.us. We have an uh, Instagram page right now and you can contact us there. The email is on the page as well if you need to contact us. All right, so you heard her. Uh, but today, we're going to be doing a new Dragon Ball unboxing. Juliana, what are we unboxing? This is Master Lee's The Greatest Saiyan, Super Saiyan 4, Gogeta. 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 Oh, that's the back. At the front of the box. Oh, that's the front. <laughs> uh, yes, it's my latest Ichiban Kuji. I think uh, we've already unboxed Super Saiyan 4 Goku and the Golden Ozuru from this series. We are just missing Gogeta and Vegeta. Uh, Vegeta's like stuck in the mail. I'm recording this at the end of the year right now, so it's taking its time to get here from Japan, but it'll get here eventually. Um, but we'll take a quick look at the box. We'll unbox it, talk about the figure, and then do some size comparisons for scaling before our final thoughts. Here's the front of the box. Here's one side of the box. Here's the back of the box. Here's the other side of the box. Here's the bottom of the box. Here's the top of the box. And right down there in the corner is the Toei animation sticker, which means what? It means it's not a bootleg. That's right. At least you're smarter than Donnie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's open it up and uh, talk about it. All right. Take this knife. All right, Juju, what do we has? He comes with a tail in three pieces. So it's his whole body, his tail, and the support stand. All right, let's put them together and prop them up. I actually don't think he's going to need the support stand, but we can, let's try and do that first. If he falls over, then we'll put it on. All right. All right, go ahead. Okay, so here he is put together. Um, he doesn't exactly need the support, but he kind of leans back because he's like puffing out his chest. So I feel more comfortable leaving it on. Luckily, it's a, it's a clear support, so it's not like that intrusive and it wraps on like the side of his leg instead of in front of it, like, like it's an ankle brace or something. But uh, let's take a closer look before we compare him to some of the other figures. Okay, so... For those of you that don't know, the Master Lease figures are like my favorites. Uh, every time I get a, a new one, it's kind of a big competition within myself to see who's my new favorite figure. Uh, just right off the bat, his likeness is really well done. He's got that cocky Gogeta smirk. His eyes are really well done. The mold of his hair is perfect. The detail of his fur is cool and the paint application is done really well. And a big plus for me, his pants aren't like super gray, like they do with fusion characters, a lot with figures. So I really enjoy that. And the uh, like uh, blowing, the long part of his belt, it, it was already put on, so I didn't have to like stick it on as a separate piece, because usually when that happens, they pop out really easy. What you think? All right, at first glance, um, it just looks very professionally done. Um, I don't see very many flaws at all when I look at it. I love his hair and um, the way that they did his fur because it's very detailed and 
all of the paint looks good as well. So overall, I think it's just really awesome. I love his face too and the detail on the lines on his face looks really cool. Um, really, really awesome. Yeah, it looks like they kind of ripped them straight out of the anime. So it, they, they really do a good job of doing that with Master of These figures. And they even added shading on his fur too. It's uh, not super noticeable. Uh, but when you take a closer look, it does help it pop out quite a bit. He's also a really good size. He's just a little bit over 11 inches. Yep. Makes it perfect. Yep, really good size. So with that being said, let's compare him to some other Gogeta and Master Lee's figures that I have. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you have this figure, please comment down below and let me know your thoughts on it. Uh, I think for a final score, I'm going to have to give it a 7 out of 7 Dragon Balls. Uh, I love it. Um, I, I, all my Master Lee's figures are like the best ones in my collection. They're a good size, they're good detail, uh, and there's usually no defects or anything on them. So I'm really happy with them every time I get them. I agree. I would definitely give it a 7 out of 7. I don't really have any negatives to say. But if you don't have this figure, I will leave links in the description down below of where you can get him. I got him off of KujiConnect.com. He was the only figure that I won during their Kuji prize drawings. Uh, they like to do that quite a bit on their uh, website. If you want to participate in that, I'll leave a link down below, but I'll also leave other places where you can find this figure. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you want to see more Dragon Ball unboxings, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell icon so you can be notified whenever I upload a new unboxing slash review video. And of course, be sure to check out Hope Restored so you can be uplifted by the uh, grace of Jesus and be aware of the domestic violence that is very common within our country and world. Once again, thanks for watching. We hope to see you in the next video and the next Dragon Ball unboxing. Juliana, thanks for joining me, and I hope to see you again. That was really creepy. Don't <laughs> ever do that again. Uh, but we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. See you next time. Bye. 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 Bye.